I think the first time I saw someone that spoke my language, someone who was deaf, was Linda Bove on an episode of Happy Days. And I was so mesmerized. We took great pains at Happy Days to do uh, a story about every group uh, that uh, was a part of our society. And I said to myself, well, there's a, a deaf woman on the show. There's someone who is not my age, older than myself, who's deaf on television in Hollywood. How did she get there? And I thought to myself, we know when I get older, I want to be there too. I always felt that you, there was a need to be responsible and when you're depicting uh, uh, characters and you do the show every week, you have to include all the different minorities, all the different types. And uh, I think you can't underestimate seeing somebody like you. On the screen, I have twin grandchildren. They were both born with cerebral palsy. When I get a lot of flack when she was little, why do you got a kid in a wheelchair? She's a kid, well, she's in the picture. And now they're 13, so now they, it's a, what do you got a teenager in a wheelchair? But uh, they like adults in wheelchairs. They don't like kids because they feel it's too sad. But I've been saying, no, there's kids that want to see other kids. And